the Joe Rogan experience. Right. Well, that, that's where the benefit of bad things actually comes in sometimes. Like some of the best things are bad things that are good by accident. Right? Like, yeah. Like what? Like the, that, the Room movie. You ever oh, see that movie? Yeah. We, uh, <laughs> I used to introduce that movie in New York for, uh, I did it for a promo thing for Comedy Central first, but then I had never seen the movie, so I kept going back and like hosting it. And then we made a fake sequel to it. This guy, George Glass, and he, he knew Tommy, so Tommy would leave him these long messages. <laughs> it's fucking... Jesus Christ. That's how long ago this was. And uh, the guy who played... Uh, oh, hi, Mark. Gre uh, Greg, his name is... He wrote that book that they made in the movie. That guy's cool as shit. Oh, the guy who plays Mark. Yeah. And uh, But the other guy... The one who got a blowjob and he had like, who's like, oh, he goes, shiver me timbers or something. Because mm -hmm. he left his under, oh, I left me underwears in your, remember that guy? And he gets a blowjob on, on, uh, on what's his name, Weezo's couch. God, I don't remember that. Yeah, I remember every character. I saw it a bunch of times. I don't think I've ever seen it all the way through. Oh, dude. In I think the I've theater, only seen the scenes. I've never gone, no, I never went to, uh. It has like, it, it, well, at the time, I don't know if it does now, but it had like that Rocky Horror Picture Show kind yeah. of thing, which I never did that. So at movie theaters, people would go and group but watch But this it? movie, group watching it, you, it feels like right to yell at it. <laughs> I, I swear to God, like I immediately, I, I thought it was like a, I'm like, I'm not going to get it. I immediately was like, oh, this, I really understand this. Um, and people yell, well, sometimes they'll have a band playing and like, <laughs> yeah, it was great. It was fucking awesome. But the Rocky Horror Picture Show, they do that because they actually like it. Yeah, but... This is a different vibe, Yeah, right? it's very hard. I mean, he's genuinely a fucking maniac <laughs> and hard to deal with. I had to have... Dude, I had my girlfriend and another friend dress kind of like slutty and distract him so he wouldn't see the parody thing we made before we showed it look and leave. The, look at the reviews. <laughs> yeah, but that... Dude, nobody... <sighs> listen, to, to make a thing that's watchably bad is like... That's a beautiful thing that can only it is. rarely happen. Yeah, it's it's interesting. Like the the room is so unfeasibly bad, it has become a cult hit. <laughs> Trust me, this is the worst movie you will ever see ever in your entire it's, life yeah. ever. <laughs> but it's it's like But it's amazing because when, it's real. when they say worst, they have to be I mean, we they, watchable where it's not boring. That's the thing. Right. It's just not it's boring. It's crazy. So, I think that's like a real lightning in a bottle. It's the worst movie because they're trying to make a good movie. It's not the worst movie to right. watch. I think it's the best to go to a thing, a theater of people. <laughs> the it's best. like the yeah. best. People are shouting at the screen oh like, because you have cancer. <laughs> <laughs> the old lady with cancer. It's, it's such a crazy movie. When did you see it? When did you? Hear I've only it? seen I, I've only seen it on like uh, I guess it was DVD at the time, mm. or what? And I only watched like part of it, and then I had to shut it off. I'm like, I can't do this. Did you ever see the? Doc I remember that. I remember those billboards, Jamie. When I when I lived here early in the Hollywood days, when right after they made this movie, I would drive around and see that billboard. It was up there forever, forever. Yeah. He had the room, the movie, and we were like, ah, oh, the room movie dot com. You drive by it. Like, what year was that? I can't, I'm trying to remember. I I might have made it up because I'm like I've seen this, but I feel like I've seen it in person. So really? It been, but I don't know when. He it might have out. had it up. He yeah. might have had it up still. He was he had a billboard up forever. Yeah. Wait, what, what year was the movie made though? 2003. It said. What? Yeah. How's that possible? Well, well I've missed it. it. I yeah. I would have thought it was way earlier than that. But he also mul multiple billboards. There's one where it was coming soon. How old is he? And Nobody yeah. knows. Damn, I never saw the the top one coming soon. Well, actually, How old is he? I don't know. He's it looks like an older fella. Um, there's, but there's a, a couple movies like that. Like Showgirls is a movie like that where it's so. I don't remember it. I, I just vaguely bad. remember. It. That's a good, it's a good one. Um, is that the end of Elizabeth Berkeley after that? It's hard to bounce back from some of those movies. But because the movie is so bad or because it was, uh, you know. Who knows, man? She went from Saved by the Bell to being a dirty girl. She's in the... So did Screech. <laughs> they brought back Saved by the Bell? Yeah, it's later. Look at this. Wow. She oh. looks good. Yeah. Looking good, freak. It just made it. Mario Lopez looking good. Everybody's looking good. So what are they coming back as the uh, the parents? Yeah. Or some shit? Zach is... Back I don't in the know. There's a bunch of jokes referring to it, and there's a bunch yeah. of new jokes about like iPads and blah. blah, blah. Are they going to let Screech <laughs> back in? I don't think so. Screech was out there doing no, porn. Screech I wrote a is book like about them. I don't think that. Oh, he was mean in the book, yeah. right? Behind the yeah. bell or something. Something like that. 
Screech was doing stand up. There was uh, Skippy from Family Ties. Remember when he was doing stand up? Yes. Remember you know who like, lived with him? Judah Freelander no was his way. roommate. Oh, that's right. Yeah, and he said that's Skippy right. would just like be in his room. He's like he would smoke pot all day, and then he would come out and be like, "Did you eat my?" It was like a. He goes, "I'm gonna have a sandwich, and I'm not gonna touch it for a while, but I want that sandwich." <laughs> so, and he would always come out freaked out about missing a call to something. What happened to him? Does he still do stand up now, or no? I don't know. Now I'm Skippy I just with used nuts. To remember, I used to remember. That was his thing. Is that what it said? He would go, That's what yeah, he said? like he's dirty now. He's oh, like Skippy with nuts. Get it? I don't know. He um, would always be there. Like I, I never met him. I don't think. And maybe I met him one time. But he would always be on the wall. Like coming next week, Skippy from Family Times. I remember <laughs> that was the first guy that I worked in a club where he worked. That I was like, oh yeah, that guy from TV. He's coming <laughs> next week. <laughs>